county treasurer um, basically is what people obviously think is that we are the banker for the county. We accept all the transmittals that other departments take in and obviously take it to the bank. Um, and when we get quite a bit, we invest in CDs. And then we turn around and use <coughs> that money to pay off our um, townships in our city and our other units within the county with the interest from that and the monies that we've collected from the township for taxes, because we collect taxes. We collect delinquent taxes. A lot of people think that um, the original bills come from us, and they don't. They come from the local units, the, the townships and the city. We don't get those books until all the taxes are delinquent, and that's when we start collecting them. Um, we clear deeds, make sure that um, property descriptions match what we have in our system and we want to make sure that taxes are paid before a deed is transferred into a new name. Do you like math? Were you good at math as a kid? Um, actually, I loved math as a kid. Um, through middle school, I was all A's in math, and when I got to high school, I said I was going to take all four years. And after the second year, I struggled a little bit and decided maybe I wasn't as good <laughs> as I thought, and I actually went into cosmetology instead of <laughs> Just tell me something, tell me a story, I guess, about you, uh, from your childhood or young adult life. You know, I moved to Big Rapids when I was 18, to originally to go to school. And I started working at Winters Creek um, Bar, <laughs> and um, my husband, that's where I met him, he was a maintenance man, and uh, he was a city boy. Um, I didn't want anything to do with a city or with a townie, I guess is what they usually call them, townies. I didn't want anything to do with them. I was a city girl. And uh, he would try and woo me. He would leave little notes on my car at night because I worked nights, he worked days. Um, he would try and spell out, you know, the whistle woo woo. <laughs> I can't whistle, so I can't can't do that. But he would spell it out, um, www. <laughs> it was he was he's a romantic. Um, one day I was uh, on my way to work, and I had a flat tire, and it was snowing like crazy. And I pulled into um, the gas station up here. It was Dale, and I don't remember the name of the gas station, but it's not there anymore. I think it's Snyder's Meat Market now. <laughs> and he just happened to be there, and Dale, the owner, would not look at my tire or fix it for me. So Randy fixed it for me. And, you know, I was still scared of him because he was still a townie, and he finally wooed me over. <laughs> um, our, our boss had a, a little girl. She was um, about two, and she was sitting at the bar one day with her little M&Ms, and, and Randy was trying to teach her colors with the M&Ms, and my heart just melted. And <laughs> Isn't that crazy? So, yeah, now I'm a townie. <laughs> I want to say thank you to my friends and my family mostly for helping me through this whole appointment process and I am looking forward to their support next year for an election. <laughs>